Okay, so it's my brother John. Um, he's gonna quickly before we start, uh, we'll be we'll be starting off with the the Glocks, um, Glock 17s. We're running a, a KSC. John has got his a uh, TM version. Um, kit wise, I'm running the ATS model war belt with the ATS insert. I've got two HSGI pistol tacos storing the actual magazines. I've got a Warrior Assault Systems dump pouch for dumping empties. Serpent type holster mounted on a QD mount system and there's the strike molly plate attaching it to the belt itself. I'm using uh, Eagle insert 9mm pouches from various kits. I've got a custom tactical tailor based arm pouch and a sort of generic mole holster for the moment. So yeah, um, I'd say we'll be, uh, we'll be running the Glock 17s for this one. Um, uh, I'll then, we'll then do a couple of different styles of guns just to illustrate the point that these drills you know, they, they really are exactly the same uh, or certainly almost exactly the same regardless of which type of Casper Lovac pistol you might be using. Um, so we've got a target set up just over it and uh, we'll run through basic load first. So you've got your weapon holstered at this point reach down, quick look down, don't need to stare down at it, quick look, comes out, up in front of you, head into the magazine, drag comes out, into the weapon, firmly, grab the slide, rack it, ready to go. Holster up, in the game, your, uh, your primary runs dry, for whatever reason, and you switch to your holster, to your secondary weapon. So, Put the pistol out, put on target, enemy presents himself, and the empty drops out, fresh one, keep the mag well, rack it, fire So this time, to um, reinforce the point I was making before about the fact that different sorts of weapons pretty much run the exact same drill, um, or certainly very close, um, I'm going to be using my TM SIG 226. John's going to be again with his TM Glock 17 and uh, basically giving you guys the opportunity to see two different GBB handguns running the drills and in fact you know, it really is all the same sort of stuff. Um, so at the moment empty guns, not cock, not no BBs chambered, magazine holsters or in pouches. Um, start off before the game, safe zone, gun comes out, mag comes out, good in its grip. Pause before the mag well, insert, bracket, got B in the chamber. In this case, I'm going to decock the SIG, goes back in the holster, no safety catch on the block, no decocker either, so that just goes holstered in a live state basically. Um, so, say uh, you're in the game, your AEG perhaps locks up, get some sort, of, uh, some sort of jam with it, something like that. You've switched to your handgun, I'm still going to cock John's life. Um, come across target, firing, mag empty, into the dump house, fresh one out, index, pause, mag well, straight in, luckily this time, we push it in, just let the slide go forward, so then, and as uh, you will have probably seen there, same drills, just load in, power stroke, new, uh, new mag in is nice and quick, uh, even same drills between those two guns there, so uh, we'll move on to uh, the platform now. Right, switch platform again, this time we're back to the 1911 as uh, in the start of the video, um, I'm just borrowed one of my TMs, I've also got my TM, and this one's with a metal kit, that's plastic, all the same drills pretty much all the same drills as with the Glocks, as with the SIG. So, uh, yet again, empty gun, not cocked, mags and pouches, you're in the safe zone. Pistol comes out, mag comes out, index into the mag well, bracket, safety on, into the holster. You're good to go. In the event, you're skirmishing away, firing. Your primary goes down for whatever reason, you drop it to the side, pistol comes out, safety off, firing, empty mag, spin it around, dump pouch, 
fresh mag out, power stroke, firing again. There you go. Easy as that. Nice and simple. Even with me um, talking through that there, that wasn't full speed, that was explaining as I go. As you can, uh, still be talking a couple of seconds with the explanation uh, doing that full speed. Um, what we'll do, yeah, we'll do that next with the 1911s again. We'll do a full speed demo to show you how quickly it can be done. Okay, um, contrary to what I said before, uh, what we actually do, John's going to run his Glock 17 because he's got more mags for it. And then I'm going to go with the 1911. Um, we've already loaded, uh, so guns are ready in the holster. I'm just going to do a couple of sport, uh, full speed reload demos. Um, we may have probably noticed before some of the more attention or more alert of you. Uh, a lot of times, what I was forgetting was to check before going through the reload drill, um, which just highlights the fact that everyone makes mistakes. I know I certainly do. I'm far, far from perfect. I'm not the expert at all. Uh, um, do you, you forget about that as well? Yeah, probably. probably a few yeah. times. I, I know I forgot a few times. So, uh, again, just so remember that when, when the slide does lock back, just remember to give it that check and see what it is before you reload. 99.9% of the time it's going to be an empty mag for you need to reload, but you do get that odd stoppage, um, the odd jam, whatever. So worth remembering that part. Right, so like I say, we're already loaded up. Um, primary goes down for whatever reason, target presents itself, and then time goes to secondary. Been to a lot of skirmish games, mm. six fired a lot of BBs. He's messed about with it when he was still a noob, not knowing what he was doing. And since? And since when he's still a noob. <laughs> um, I'm, I, I'd still call, I wouldn't call, exactly call myself a veteran, but yeah. Um, that particular gun's had a lot of abuse. Uh, it still mostly worked. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, Cheers for watching guys, hopefully that was a bit informative for you. Any questions, anything else you'd like to know, like to see, put them in the comments, always appreciated. Uh, and uh, yeah, see you next time. Come across contact, firing. Okay.